Hello everybody and welcome back to my time in Sandrock where more concealer is needed. So much more concealer is needed for me. So um, what I am going to do today is continue with this water tower because I got lots done last time. I think I might need some more graphite. I'm not sure. I'm not actually even sure how to work out how much I need. <laughs> So much scrap on these recyclers. I'm going to start off with the recyclers. And just add some extra jobs to their queues. They're probably going to be working on things all day anyway. I either need more recyclers or less stuff. <laughs> Because the stuff just keeps coming. I need to start selling the pieces of um, equipment that I have multiples of as well. But that's fine. That's absolutely fine. So I may need to get more water. I need to keep an eye on that water situation. Grinders are finished. I need to go and get an iron latch from the Commerce Skill store. And I need to just double check that... Uh, I did hand in some commissions last episode, but there was a couple of days where I didn't really do commissions and I'm worried that I'm getting behind. Also, sadly, this episode is going to be the day of the bright sun. <laughs> Luckily, I handed my stuff in for it, but uh, I kind of would prefer to just get on with the water tower right now. But, you know, you got to do what you got to do. So day of the bright sun is going to be this episode. Um... <laughs> I need to get the thing for a latch, a harmonica, an oil lamp, arm stretcher, yakmel hat, twine, plastic pipe. Latch, please. Oh dear. Let me just, I'm sure it said here. I must be confused about where to get the... Where to get the recipe for a latch? I hope that doesn't mess me up. I'd be extremely unhappy. I need eight iron latches. So maybe we get the book and put it somewhere? No, because you can always get extras of books, so... Let me just see... Immediate work table. Steel frame. It told me somewhere where I could get it. Oh, hang on here. Uh, no, in my in my handbook, right? So handbook. I don't know which one it's for though. Because this one. Iron latch. Commerce Guild store. See the latch recipe here anywhere. Pumping pipe, steel frame, filtration core. I, I missed it somehow. It definitely says Commerce Guild store, so it's definitely that's definitely right. I was looking in the right place. I don't know if I just somehow overlooked it. I'll look really carefully, okay? So, store. Leather belt. Hair dryer. Iron latch, of course. It's the one little one that's just hiding in the middle there. Ah, Okay, never mind. Let's have a look at my rankings and stuff as well. Still ahead of Yan at the moment. And even if I do drop a touch behind him, I should be able to catch up quite well because I can take something like four commissions a day. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Some quests need to be done quickly. Check your ch quest log. Let me just double check. Make sure. I know I'm trying to do this quickly anyway. <laughs> this wasn't wasn't a timed mission. That would be terrible. Okay, back we go. We can make iron latches now. Yay! I expect that they probably need loads of iron plates or something to make them. Oh, actually, I don't think that they're made on the intermediate work table. I think they might be made over here. Iron latch times eight. I can make... Seven. Of course I can. <laughs> but we may as well start making that seven. And I need a lot of steel bars as well. So anything that I can get from the iron scrap would be quite useful. Yeah, look, I'm getting some steel bars out of that as well. I've got a couple from that. Lovely. So what do I need now? Some more iron plates. 100%. For assembly station item, I need eight. I can make a total of one. Yay! So steel bars are absolutely what is needed right now. Um, and I am nearly out of graphite. So I feel like going to the desert and getting some more graphite is going to be needed today. what we shall do. So we'll leave all the, the bits and bobs doing its thing. Hope the water doesn't run out. Go and grab some more graphite rocks. A few just down here. I think anyway, I think they were down, down here and up there. Little grey rocks like this one down here. So those and a bit of iron and we should be cooking with gas but I think we might just need a bit more than I've got you see. Raw minerals, got graphite, marble. You do get some as a byproduct of mining um, but this is a good way to get a lot really quickly. We've got enough for about 20. Uh... Oh man. The rooster is here. Roo, roo the rooster. I don't even have a way to beat him up. Did I give away my only, like, sword and shield? Probably. Sort of thing I'd do. The problem when you keep getting uh, commissions for weapons, right? I have a gun. I also have a hammer. Probably knock him out with a motivational hammer. I have a huge amount of health, so... Oi! Go off me, you! Yeah, stupid. Oh, I got rib meat from him, that's cool. And a machine upgrade kit. Wonderful. Anyway, I'm really slow with that hammer on me, so let's uh, speed it up. Do one mine level as well, quickly, while I'm over here. 
just quickly grab all the uh, iron in there and that'll probably take me to the evening but it's fine what's this nice all this stuff that I probably have totally missed in the desert I had a good old run around on the camel but I'm sure I haven't found everything that's here So I'm sure there will still be things that reveal themselves to me as I go. Does that look like a... <laughs> the thorny jumper's coming after me though. Sounds like a really bad Christmas present, doesn't it? A thorny jumper. It's already half past four and we've got the day of the bright sun tomorrow so we'll probably have the day of the bright sun and we'll get the water filter done tomorrow and it'll all be awesome and then probably so this one will probably go out um on the second i know i've got coming up a really bad time of it with uh, the internet potentially so we might have a whole day aha i caught the scorpion for once is this the real she lab? There's some weird fake she lab. Well, I just need to go and grab as much iron as I can so that we've got all of the steel um, plates and things. And then I think that's going to be. We're on level 9. Oh, I haven't made it all the way through. Well, I'm still going to enter on level 8 and reset everything because I don't care. I'm just looking for iron right now. Honestly, you're probably actually too low down for iron at this point. Oh no, there seems to be plenty. Okay, it's fine. I'm not interested in trying to find the bottom of the ruins right now. That's something that I can definitely do alongside the, the new content. Um, saving up for a house upgrade will probably be part of that. Um, just generally, I'll have a good look at all the patch notes and things. But yeah, um, yeah, due to have possible bad times with the internet on the second, so I've recorded this one to go up on the second. The last one should have gone up on the first, in theory anyway. Um, so I'm thinking we'll be starting on, on Logan's new adventures uh, on the third or fourth. Should give them plenty of time to properly get the patch out and get a like a nice stable build. I actually could have had the the build a little bit ahead of time, but I think they didn't even really want me doing any storyline stuff. They wanted me just to show off the bits that had changed with the patch, and I was like, you know what? How about I just do the patch when it comes out and don't have to worry about embargoes and things. So that's what I am doing. So we're still on the old patch at the moment. Oh, not enough stamina. Okay, cool. Let's go home then. So we've got some steel, uh, so, sorry, some iron ore. We've got some graphite. If I need a little bit more iron later, we'll get some more as well. But it's good to get all of this stuff done before the day of the bright sun. I would love to, to have a nice, uh, a good night's sleep, actually. That might be nice. But we're definitely getting there with our big list, our big giant list of things. Take a hint. I'll have to go and check that out. Very quickly. We're still at what? The 8 o'clock. Okay, that's fine. Take a hint. And so you see, uh, that mischievous little Mion made a teensy little mistake. When she said that we don't charge for overnight commissions, uh, what she meant to say is that actually, we do. <laughs> In fact, that's an understatement. We charge out the wazoo for overnight commissions. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know all about the overnight policies. It's just that Mian said she thought she could get us a discount. Yes, well, she's been overruled. 
Sorry, old pal, but if we made an exception for you, we'd have to start making exceptions for everyone. What, oh, yeah? That would be, <laughs> that would be yeah. exceptional, sorry. Well, I wouldn't want to shortchange the good folks over at the Commerce Guild. That's what I love about you, Owen. Always so perfectly punctual with your payments. Mm -hmm. Well, I must be going. My employees won't reprimand themselves, don't you know? <laughs> so long. Oh, he needs a kick up the butt, doesn't he? Really? Really, Jan? Oh, hey. Uh, you've come at just the right time. So, the wildest thing happened. Uh, Grace had a little spat with the oven and, uh, <laughs> long story short, blew the whole kitchen to smithereens. Oh, dear. So, that's why he needs overnight commissions. Don't worry. Everyone's fine. And luckily, Mian was available to help out with damage control. So that's all well and good. My issue now is that the night the kitchen exploded, Grace insisted she'd take a pay cut until all the repairs were paid for, and she wouldn't take no for an answer. But now... But she's only a poor student. Now, without Mian's discount, I just can't let Grace foot the bill. She'd be scraping by for months, if not years. I paid Yen already. It's water under the bridge in my mind. Because, you know, these things happen. I, I can't stand letting her take on such a huge burden. She's just a student. Aww. Oh, as much as so I was saying I liked Unsure, Owen is now growing on me too! Ah! Alright, so here's where you come in. As a builder, you can just convince her that the repairs aren't that expensive. <laughs> then she won't feel so bad, and maybe she'll just forget about the whole thing. It's foolproof. Uh, oh no. That is really dishonest. You know what? Sometimes it's All right. worth it. Uh, but uh, let's not be too hasty now. We need to be prepared if we're really going to change Grace's mind. She really has a way of turning things around on you. <laughs> uh, maybe she's on the debate team or something. Here's the deal. Whatever she asks you, just follow my lead. Capiche? Don't let her throw you off your game. Okay. Stick to the plan. Okay. Guess we're as ready as we're ever going to be. Let's go track down Grace. I'll be right behind you. Holy gosh, that's... um. She's not far away though, so that's fine. Oh, it said she wasn't. Why does it do this to me all the time? Ah. Oh no, she's saying she's in the oh, she's in the kitchen. She in the kitchen? Hey, Danby. Oh yeah. much happening this episode hmm. I just need to put in a bit of salt <gasps> oh, thanks boss I don't think that was salt I think that was like magnesium powder or something <laughs> oh, seems someone hasn't quite learned their lesson but uh, that's neither here nor there uh, look who I've brought your friendly neighborhood builder here to help us come to a, a conclusion on that whole explosion incident. Oh, hey! And you're still on about that, Owen? That was a terrible mess, and I'm completely to blame. I'll be footing the bill in full for the kitchen restoration, regardless of what you may have told the builder here. Uh, hey, uh, come on, Grace. It's it's no biggie. And, and even if it was, the Blue Moon has plenty set aside for rainy days. Or explosive days, for that matter. <laughs> explosive anyway, days. everything is taken care of now. And it hardly cost me a dime. Uh, don't believe me? Just ask for a second opinion here. Owen is winking at me. All right, I'll bite. You plan to tell me the truth now, don't you? Totally. Let's begin. What is your name? Huh? Where are you going with this one? I have my reasons. Your name, please? Okay. Yeah. Next question. Next. Where are you from originally? High wind. High wind. Nice weather this time of year, yes? Very oh, she windy, changed to the other Grace. Oh, the scary other Grace. That'll do. Now I know what you look like when you're deciding whether or not to answer truthfully. 
Next, I'll be asking what I really want to know. And don't even think about bending the truth to help Owen change my mind. Got it? I can read you like a book. <laughs> now, Builder, tell me, how much did it cost to renovate the blue room kitchen? Okay. <clears throat> you know, uh, more than a few glasses of milk, <laughs> but less than a herd of yakmo. <sighs> Grace, it's fine. I wish you'd just forget about all this. Um, a bit cheap. <laughs> yep, just like I said. Hmm, I see. Next, the events in question occurred two days prior, and on the second day, when I came to work, the kitchen was already as good as new. Something here doesn't add up. Don't tell me you builders are dabbling in magic. Explain. What's your angle, Grace? The two new builders in town are both riled up and full of vinegar. You're just used to old Mason and his whiny ways. Nothing unusual here, right? Yep, normal. I could do it too. <clears throat> I see. Next question. I know what it's like to be a student and in debt and horror. I, I, I still have student debt, actually. Regardless, <sighs> Owen must have had to pay me on for working overnight. Tell me how much of that would have been. Ah, uh, well, uh, be that as it may, <laughs> the kind lady that she is, Mian gave me a discount. Uh, the difference in the bill was so small, I almost forgot about yeah, it. Yeah, just a little more than usual. Okay, next question. I think I'm getting away with this. Grace, 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 Grace. Enough with the third degree. There's really nothing more to be said. Boss, you sure have a lot to say for someone who says there's nothing to say. Why do you always butt in whenever I ask a question, huh? It's starting to seem like you two are in cahoots. <laughs> cahoots? I, I mean, uh, what, what even What even is, is the cahoot? <laughs> really? I think this whole ordeal has you on edge. Uh, but, all right. Have it your way. I'll zip it. Continue with the interrogation, please. What even is the cahoot? <laughs> if something like this happened in the Commerce Guild, would your boss, Yan, handle it like Owen? Which is to say, would he insist on paying the damages out of his own pocket? No flipping way. <laughs> this is Yan. Oh, I don't know what to say here. Because that, that, that's too big a lie. Uh, well, you, you never know. Remember when you first got to Sand Rock and Yen was there waiting with open arms? <laughs> Why, he must have walked over 12 steps Some lies are too big. To... What happened to Zip It? Ah, I did say that. Those are words said by me. Hmm, bet you two think you're pretty slick, huh? Owen, it couldn't be more obvious. You did put up to this little charade, however... All right, that's the ticket. Oh, whew. now we can finally move on from this. Owen, I must say, your dedication to your employees makes you not just the owner here, but an inspiring leader as well. I'm proud to call you my friend. <laughs> oh, shucks. Well, I think we wouldn't be seeing eye to eye if not for the builder here. <laughs> uh, you might even say we have an unspoken bond. Here, take this for your troubles. Call it a consultation fee. Consultation fee, like it. Yes, thank you for helping us resolve this. I'm in your debt. No, no. <laughs> no debts. That's the whole point of all <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's get back to it. Catch you, Builder. All right. Can I go back to my house now and carry on making this water tower? Hello again, Dambi. So, let's see, while we've been out in the desert, what has uh, finished making. So we need now three more iron plates plus another eight iron plate. No, one. We need nine more, nine more iron plates. Eight iron latches. Oh no, there's like three lots of iron plates. Oh gee. I'm glad I went to get more, more iron. Right, so let's just top 
top up all of the steel bar cues. And uh, we're we're doing okay actually, we're doing fine. And then just this just needs to be just like Iron Plate City over here. So I apparently need It's saying I need more rubber shells. But iron plates so I apparently need six. I need more than six. make as many as I can make basically unfortunately I think I only have one civil processor at the moment I could maybe do with more uh, that's something I could look into as I'm expanding the workshop and things second civil uh, all right, civil grinder do we need anything we need these iron latches ah yay Do I already make some? I already made seven out of eight of the iron latches. So if I could just make one more, which I can, that would be everything I need from that point of view. Let's keep these tidy. And then I need to go to bed because we've got the Festival of the Bright Sun tomorrow and I don't want to be all like uh, panda-eyed for it. I feel like we're doing really well. We're up. It's bright and early. I'm going to put these wall lamps on again, I think. Should I have more than one? I think I did somewhere. On the other side of the fish, I guess. All right. Off we go. So we'll have a quick uh, poke around the yard. Check on things in general. And then we'll do the day of the bright sun. So let's have a look. I think it's today anyway. Burgess, hope all's well over your workshop. I can see you from the water tower. I had a little extra money on hand, so I thought maybe I could get some water for you to aid you in your quest to build stuff for our town. Just doing my part. You keep those machines running. Good luck. Thanks, Burgess. That's actually, like, super duper useful. Got no fuel left. Water's actually pretty low, too. Okay, so we've got a little bit of water in there. Everything should be working, working away. Got some iron plates now. So I'm going to put the iron plates onto the water tower, onto the water tank. Because I have enough now for that. So water tank is done. Fantastic. And um, we need to go and do... How's my bag looking? Hmm. Let's see if I can quickly do a little sort all and get my bag a little bit emptier. There we are. That should be enough. It's not like I do well at the day of the bright sun. Wow, look! Look at all this stuff they put up overnight for it. Usually it's not too big a thing. Like, uh, time-wise. I figure we're up in the... In the square, we are indeed. Might need to wait a few minutes until so nine o'clock. So let's enjoy the day, and remember to always strive to be better than yesterday. Well, I won't keep you any longer. Come stand next to me. Happy day of the bright sun. Day of the bright sun. So where's the air balloon? The air balloon is there. Where's the presents going? Gonna fall though. Purple fireworks. Chilies. Which 
way is it going? Oh, this way, okay. Not quite as ridiculously bad as it used to be. It used to be terrible. Okay, so you're best off not watching them fall, I think. You're best off going for the present as you see it. Whoa, they're so fast. Here they come. Oh, I nearly got that one. There's more falling now. Where are they going to land, though? Ah! I suck at this. Oh, they'll start falling in 25 seconds. Oh, okay. So it went it went over there that time. So maybe it will come over here this time. I don't know. No, oh, they got we went over there that time. I'm trying, I'm trying. Ah, it was in the way again. Right, I think it will be this one this time. On to the other two previously, so. Probably still won't get a present. Yes! Well, I got, I think, about four presents there, so it wasn't a total, a total waste. Um, it might have been three, actually. Three or four presents. I got, I did really well at the start, and I was like, oh, this is great. And then, and then it started getting competitive. Okay, so is that it? Or is there anything more to do with that one? Talk to people. Hello there. And yeah, I had sunscreen. Oh, okay, I could get you sunscreen. The day of the bright sun is a lovely opportunity to give some of my works out to the people of the town as gifts. I think that a gift made by your own hands is always so much more meaningful. I think so too. All right, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna yeah. run up and get Amira some sunscreen because I need some concealer anyway. Hopefully the. All right, I'll get some water in the water tank as well because I've got a couple of extras now. Buy this day, so let's get some sunscreen and some concealer. Never have too much concealer. Let's see if I can find a mirror with that. Because this this gives you like some some clues as well to the things that they enjoy, things they like. Mm, did she stay here? Yes, yeah, she did. Lovely. A mirror. I have some screen for you. Hopefully, you will like it. 
Didn't I already have some? Must have done. How did you know? Well, thank you all the same. Goodbye. Important to take time to do things like that. I sometimes don't, like... Like I say, sometimes in the early access versions, I'm not as um, fastidious with all that stuff as I would be in the full version. So full version, I'm very, very... I, I like to really go for it. Metal. Loads of stuff. Right, okay. So that's the next thing I want to do. I'm thinking the hardest one is going to be the tower frame so i'm thinking if we do the filter next let's see if we've got the stuff we need for that so we don't have the iron plate which is not surprising we do have the filtration cores and we do have the pumping pipes and so with that one we're just waiting for iron cores at the moment right we're totally out of water so that's no good oh off goes the the, the balloon i like that that's a nice little extra bit of interest added isn't it you know so it's all about the iron right now all about these steel bars so i've got the i think that's the last iron latch done now iron latch one out of eight i thought that we'd done I am really confused. Maybe I needed them for the water tank as well? But I thought I was done with the latches. Did they somehow go into No, so they should even be put they should be pulling from my chests even if they're in a chest though. If I sort all, will that go away somewhere? It has done, yes. So Let's just have a little look around for iron latches. I don't know why they would have gone into an inventory somewhere. I have 24 of them. What? I am so confused. But we certainly do not need any more <laughs> iron latches. That is ridiculous. Let's hope that there's some um, commissions for that at some point. If I've used iron on that, though, I shouldn't have used it. I should have used that on iron plates. More iron plates, please. Just keep going with them. How are we doing for iron in general? I think we have enough, to be honest. Just keep going with it. Getting a bit low on iron, so I could go get some more iron if I wanted to. I could just literally sit and wait. We're just waiting on these iron plates at the moment. And steel frames as well. Let me just double check on what they need. Probably some iron. Oh no, manganese steel bars and these cast iron rods. I do need to queue some of those up. Once I get a bit more steel. Hmm. Okay, let's see if there's any more ready yet. Yeah. There is. I feel like I'm going to be just babysitting these, honestly. When I get one more piece of steel, I can put the other cast iron rod on. Which I can do now. Now, I may, I may uh, put that to the front of the queue. I like that you can swap the queues around as well. That's quite nice. You can add to the queue. You can swap the queue around. That'll allow me to make my steel frames. That's saying eight. Cast iron rods. Do I? Do you make? It's not saying that it makes two or anything. I only have two queued up. I'd be interested to see how many come out. 
But that is 12 minutes worth still. Unfortunately. So part of me is like, could I make another civil civil processor or something? Because that, that's really what's holding me up at the moment. Typically. So yeah, we just now need iron plates and steel frame. So I think what I'm going to do is something a bit unusual. Um, I'm going to let's make sure the water's it's as adjusted as I can get it. Okay. I'm going to do a third day as part of this episode. I feel like it's important to get this part of the storyline done before we start on the next bit. Um, but I feel like all I'll be doing is babysitting the machines overnight. So I feel like it'd be better. They're not growing properly due to bad conditions. Well, I need to... Yeah, I need to look after doodles a bit better today as well then. So maybe I need to go get doodles some tomatoes or potatoes or some sand berries or something. Something nice to eat. It's probably more about the water though. So let's go and see Burgess first. Get the water all sorted out. And get everything in the workshop going. This will be an extra long episode, but I think it's okay. We'll be back to the normal two days when uh, when the, the new patch comes out. But like I say, I just wanted to really get on top of this. Yeah, let's get eight. Eight will keep us going for a while. I lose more money by not having the water, to be honest. I'll also take any water that I can get off of my condensers. I'm, I know I'm really bad at like leaving the condensers. And I'll probably, like, my house is still a big work in progress, I know. I'll probably be working on that uh, quite a bit. Once the new patch is out. I keep saying that. Once the new patch is out, I'll do this and that and the other. Nice. Okay. Hey, Doodles. Let's pet Doodles. Let's make sure Doodles has... Some potatoes. I think they're fairly happy. Do I have anything like sand berries like kicking around or? It's saying I don't. And I think it does take it out. Yeah, it does. Okay, that's fine. So everything's going nicely now. We'll get some more water made. I will dust off these guys as well. Things don't work so well when they are dusty. Cyclers need to, they need to stay working. All the time. Apple scrap, wood scrap. I don't even know what I'm doing at this point. I'll just shove some stuff in there and hope for the best. Copper scrap is getting quite high at the moment. I feel like one more would, would, would definitely help. Alright, let's get these squeaky clean as well. So they can make those iron plates as fast as possible. That's what we are waiting for right now. Right. Next. I got a perfect one as well. That's nice. We now need... We've done the water filter, the water tank. We now need the tower, the 
the water filter frame. So we've got loads of latches. For some reason I made like a million of them and they, they hid themselves. Iron plate, bronze pipe. So it's, it's five iron plates and two steel frames. Steel frames remind me. Oh no, I need more cast iron rods. I need more manganese steel bar as well. Let's uh, change that over. I'm glad I caught that actually, otherwise we need more iron. Okay, so I've got one steel frame out of two. Uh, iron plate. I need another five. No, I don't. I need now another four. I've got two queued up. So I need another two. And I need another four of these uh, cast iron rods. And I'm thinking to myself while I'm waiting for those to work, well, we can make some more water to start with. I could just go and take a commission quickly, couldn't I? Make a bit of water there. Yeah, I'm going to go take a commission. I'm going to see. Nothing too difficult. I think we can take quite a lot of commissions at this point. I'm going to have to wait. I'm not very good at waiting. Looks like Fang has a keen sense for advertising. That wasn't what I wanted to look at. Tanned leather. Filtration cores. So I think I could take the tanned leather one. What do I need to do for tanned leather? Tailoring machine. Yeah, go for it. Bloodstone core. I reckon I could do. Um, copper wire I could do because that's that's a grinder thing. All right. I don't really want to be taking things for like metal hinges, steel frames, filtration cores, silver rules. No, none of those. We'll just do some real simple ones. But I'm a level four workshop now, so you notice I took three commissions in a row. I might have been able to take four, I'm not sure. I don't really want to take that many today because I've got a lot to do, but. Uh... So to make tanned leather, I need coarse leather. So I'm gonna see if I can just go and buy something off Vivi to help with that. Can I buy some coarse leather, basic leather? Thin thread. Hmm. Ah, oh, don't worry. I'll go down and see what I need for it. We can. I'm sure we can get it. I need twenty coarse leather. I might have to like. I don't know. Slay some wee beasties. I have had the camel outside here the whole time, and I've been running around like a crazy fool. That's, that's just typical she lab for you, isn't it, really? One more iron plate is done. <laughs> Three more to go. And then those four other things need to be done. And then we are done with this. Okay, so. Many more steel bars. We've got one of the manganese bars done. I need like five, don't I? My bloodstone core, easy. Halo machine, tanned leather. So I need salt. Uh -huh, that's why Owen wanted to, wanted that. He wants to sell me salt. That's what it is. I need five for my mission, and so I need coarse leather for monsters. I have to go monster hunting in the desert then. Ooh, 
doesn't say which monsters, just says monsters. Maybe if I go through the little, uh, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do that. We'll have to see. I do not know which monsters. So do I go through the ruins? Do I go out to the desert? I think out to the desert is probably the way. Do I take my camel? Also, I've got like, I need to make copper wire, I think. Let's get that on the go. Are you happy, Doodles? Are you growing now? Are you properly growing? You're still growing. You're 47% grown. And you're 90% energy. So I think he's okay. I think he's alright. After ride. Well, let's head out to the desert, Mr. Camel. And see what monsters we can get coarse leather from, if anything. I'm kind of thinking, do we need to go into the breach for it? But I don't know. I can't. I'm not sure which monsters drop that coarse leather. Maybe I shouldn't have taken such a difficult one. I thought I could maybe buy it, but no. It's like from monsters. I'm like, which monsters again? It needs to be outstanding quality. I don't mind trying to make it up in quality as well. That would be fine. I thought that would be an easy commission, and I was like, nope. I love that we've got the sand, uh, the sand running place out here as well. I love that uh, I'm making a difference. Oh, I still don't have any like good weapons, but the kangaroo is the most likely thing to happen. Leather, probably. I'm trying to be careful not to like hit my camel. Oh, I got three coarse leather off of him. So yeah, we need to, to get him a few times. Are there any others of him? There's the thorny jumpers, there's the penskis, the boxing jacks habitat is around here. But I think he's quite a, he's more of a rare one, so maybe he's not around all the time. Oh no, there's another one. Oh, there's like loads of them. Yay! I'll just fight them. I do need to make myself another weapon though. I'm hoping that I can get one like every I get three every time I hit a like hit one. Two that time. That's not so bad. So I've got five coarse leather. I got twelve, so twelve out of twenty. But it is getting late. I need to go back. How long have I got to do that one then? It's not as bad when you can take three at once. 
One day 16 hours, two days 16 hours, two days 16 hours. I've got three days to do that. So I could just get the leather that I'm already that I've already got going on the thing. Buy some salt and stuff. And come and get like another just need another eight. I feel bad because I feel like it's going to be dark when I do the water tower now. I didn't want it to be dark by the time I did the water tower. So what I may do is do it first thing in the morning and just use a day for that. It's not my usual modus operandi, but I want to basically have all the stuff together, get the... We're coming up to just about an hour. We've had longer episodes than that before. Oh, are you kidding me? The generator just ran out of fuel. So it's good that I came back when I did. Now I can... <laughs> did it just screech to a halt there? That was hilarious. Get that generator full of drags. 100%. You need to stay put. Camel. Stay. <laughs> oh, it's working on those rod those cast iron rods, nice. So I need another steel frame. I think it's a second one that I need. Need two more manganese steel bars and I need the other three of those. Okay, yeah, they need to they need to be worked on overnight then. I'll try and make sure that the that everything is ready. Other than that. That's my things for my commission. Um we've done the bloodstone cores. I need a steel frame, so I'm waiting for the cast iron rods for that. We have the iron plates now. So I think we are just waiting for one steel frame. Yeah. So I'm going to, I think, head to bed. Let that, well, uh, maybe not actually, because if I've got the... I've got things to hand in, haven't I? I've got commissions to hand in. I could start the leather tanning two that I can do. I can do a third one once I have the salt. And then I need another eight uh, of those roo skins. So I can just hang around the desert like getting roo skins. That's no problem. I've got a couple of days to get that done. Uh, inventory's a mess again. <laughs> At some point I will properly sort that out. I'm going to have a quick look at my quests and just uh, hand in the ones I can hand in, which are uh, for Hugo and for Amber. Am I tracking those ones? No, I'm only tracking the ones that I don't have done because that's clearly what I need to be doing, right? Untrack that, track that, track that. Right, where are you guys? I think they are all in bed. So we'll go and hand those in in the morning, I think. Uh, alongside everything else. It's like a mega bumper episode, isn't it? But it's how I'm going to catch up with everything. So we'll go to sleep. And uh, I will hand in the commissions. And we will finish this water tower in the morning. That's what we will do. So... I'm hoping I will wake up to it all being done. All the pieces. Come on. Just sometimes the machines take so long, don't they? Okay, so my, my bits of tailoring have been done. Lovely. Just get these recyclers. Ready for the day ahead. Yeah. You 
beautiful. Add to the iron scrap for you, though. Wood scrap, we can add to that a bit. Copper scrap, we can add that onto the queue. Quite a bit of water sort of adding up now as well. So, we should be at a point now where the steel frame is doable. Lovely. I don't want to retrieve all. I want to put the steel frames on. Pick that up. We are finished now with that. Appetite for construction. So let's go and hand it in. Well, that is what I wanted to do this whole time. This is what this episode was all about, so... I don't mind that it took a few days. We got the Day of the Bright Sun done in the meantime. I got a few presents at it. I'm not the best at it, to be honest. Hugo's, like, on the way. <laughs> I love that sound effect. Well, how, how long has that been in there? Howdy. Okay, so we found Hugo. Lovely. Probably also find Amber without too much difficulty, honestly. Amber's at home. Yeah, it's only if you if you if you're going at normal speed, it just stops normally. But if you're going fast, it goes. <laughs> exactly what I was looking for. Banged it out real too. Appreciate ya. Thank you. That's just my two little commissions that I could do. So I need to go and install those components of the water tower now, and then we need to go and beat up some ruse. I will finish off the day. Uh, you can have an extra super long episode. It'll be fine. <laughs> it does mean that the that the first episode will go up really, really late, but it's fine. I think it's important that we just get these two episodes done, ready for the new patch. So. Install! Install! And install! Go on, Shilab. Go on, Mian. Get that water tower back up and sturdy and secure. The water tower is back. You builders did a mighty fine job once again. Just in time, too. I believe our next shipment of water is scheduled to arrive tomorrow. Our town owes you two our gratitude. Commissioner, you really ought to handsomely reward these builders for their efforts. Uh, right. I'll add that to the tab as well. Okay, appetite for construction and talk to Yan. Well, well. Bang up job on the uh, water tower, I must say. You know, it's funny. When you and Mian got here, I bet old Mason the two of you wouldn't last a week. Luckily, he's so far off by now, I doubt I'll ever have to make good on that bet. <laughs> now, uh, where was I? Ah, that's right. You did such a good job of following orders that I've decided on behalf of the Commerce Guild that you deserved a bonus for all your hard work. And because Matilda told you to. Here's the amount promised by the city and... 50 goals on... <laughs> <laughs> Don't spend it all in one place. Bye bye now. That's like three face creams. Hilarious. Achievement unlocked. Got the flow back. Congratulations, Builder. You've successfully completed all the main story quests in the current early access version. We will continue to update these main quests, among others, throughout development. You may continue to spend time in Sandrock, taking commissions from the Commerce Guild, developing your relationships with the residents. Uh, expanding your workshop, exploring ruins, traveling the world, participating in many other activities available in the current version. Keep a look out for the next update, which will be very, very soon. So, we have finished that now. Um, so I'm going to probably just save up here. Um, what I might actually... Well, part of me is thinking, how about we just... Just before we end it, how about we get that commission finished? Uh, for the leather because what I don't want to do is have that outstanding and also I do want to sleep I want to make sure that when the new patch comes in 
all of my there's no reason for it to bug out or anything like that because sometimes when things uh, update it's probably better that I, I'm starting a new fresh day rather than a save that's like halfway through a day so I'm kind of thinking we'll just quickly get the rest of the rue leather together and then have a sleep it'll be a bit of a longer episode but I don't really care it's fine we've actually done a lot this episode Sometimes you get really long episodes because um, each day takes forever, but these days have actually been pretty quick. We've actually, we're on our fourth day in a row now. So we're just going to be like bashing a roo with a hammer for a while. It seems to work pretty well, generally. be less terrible if I didn't have to constantly worry about my poor camel getting eaten by a boxing jack. This one's an even higher level. This is a level 28 one. Give me the leather. So that was three. I need another five now. Oh, there's his friend. Okay. It seems like whenever I kill one, another one pops up, which is quite nice. I think I only need to do another, like, three, and then I can get the, uh... That's all the leather done, then. Over here. I don't know if I can only do two a day, though. I'm hoping not. I'm hoping a third one will spawn. Three more coarse leather there. I need two more. Let's see if another one... We'll ride around a bit and see if another one spawns. And then that will be all, all the things that I pretty much wanted to get done done but this is definitely his like little spawn area so if we just ride around for a tiny bit I could maybe get some graphite while I'm here thorny jumping cactus So we might just get to a day. I might have to see some of the other guys around here. Give me coarse leather. I don't really want to do a fifth day just so I can get one kangaroo. I wonder, sometimes um, in Porsche, if you reloaded the area, things would, would reload. So, I'm going to go in and out of the mine and just see if that uh, allows for a respawn, because that sometimes did, did used to work. So just go in and out. In and out. Uh, what was it? Super quick adventure? I'm not sure. Uh, Rick and Morty is like... In and out something adventure. Oh man. Let's see. If that helps with respawning. Because the llamas used to always respawn in Porsche if you went in and out your house. So I'm wondering if it will help the kangaroos to respawn going in and out the mine. It is a possibility. But they might be counted as like slight boss mobs. No, no kangaroos. 
Okay, let's see if any of the other things give me... Any of the other mobs around here will give me uh, coarse leather. There's thorny jumpers, there's penskis. I'm thinking penskis, tripions. And then whatever's down there, I don't know. I'm thinking it's the penskis I'm gonna have to do. I doubt a thorny jumper is gonna have. Oh, it might do. Gonna have what I need, but. Uh... Blow up the pens keys. <laughs> wow. Wasn't entirely what I intended. I'm pretty lucky that I'm alive right now. We did get coarse leather. I actually got all the coarse leather I needed from them. <laughs> oh, I feel so mean. But that took most of the day, so so I'll stick that on the uh, tanning machine. I don't think it should matter too much that there's one commission that's going across, going across a patch. That shouldn't matter, I don't think. And the next time we log in, that'll be all ready for us. No, I need to ride. I need to ride to camp. Oh. Fine. It'll come home anyway. So it's going to be past midnight by the time I get... No, it won't. That's not the time. That's how long it takes me. It'll be night time though. Let's quickly shove that leather onto the machine. I could actually ride my camel to do that. And then we are up to date with everything that I wanted to do uh, before, before this new patch. So we're all ready for when it releases. And I am going to be super happy to share all of the new content with you and to see why it's called Logan Strikes Back. I'm going to be really interested in like what Logan has to do with it all. And yeah, I'm just, oh no, I don't have salt, darn. So next time we, next time we come into this, I'm going to go to bed now. We've got a couple of days for it to, to go through. So I'll just need to go straight to the blue moon. In fact, the blue moon's open. I'll go get the salt and I'll get it started because otherwise I'll forget. You know what I'm like. So we'll just quickly do that before I end the episode and then uh, we will. Yeah. Oh, I, do, I could go on my camel. Ah! <laughs> I'll quickly do that before the end and uh, that way next time I log in the commissions, I won't have to worry about like half done commissions and things. We'll just have to hand it in. All the salt. I hope that's the right kind of salt. I think it is. You get more than newspapers delivered to your mailbox. Check for letters and important updates. I really should subscribe to the newspaper. <laughs> I just sometimes feel like I've got enough reading to do. Go, Hamel, go. I can't wait to get a horse that I can train myself. That will be wonderful. I don't know, like, um, again, which sort of patch that will be in, but they definitely had it in Porsche, so I see no reason why they wouldn't have it in this version. In this game. So, there's the rest of my three leathers all ready to go. And 
and I am going to go to sleep but I'm going to save it up and then hopefully we should have a nice smooth transition to the new patch and all the new cool story content and it's going to be so cool so I hope you will come back now the water is tower is repaired all the prices have gone back to normal so I hope you enjoyed if you did then please do leave me a like below if you'd like to see more uh, new spangly storyline uh, sandrock then please subscribe I'll let you know when the videos are out I hope to see you next time in the meantime please look after yourselves and keep being awesome